Welcome to my channel, Booms Be Beauty. If you are new to my channel, my name is Juliana. Welcome to the first official 2023 video on my channel. So you might have seen one or two, I think, but those were filmed in 2022. So this will be the official first video filmed in 2023 that you'll be seeing on my channel. I just felt like I needed um, a bit of a refreshing. I did do it um, last year as well. Um, I believe it was one of the first videos on my channel in 2022. You know, just a little bit of welcome to the new year. Um, to check on you guys how are you doing um, for me not so good I'm getting better now but for the last I want to say about two three weeks yeah not so good um, mentally and you know otherwise yeah in the last um, few weeks I felt really overwhelmed and you know just a, a lot going on a lot going on and going on at the same time so yeah it's not been the easiest of times if i'm being honest but at the same time i'm glad that it's a new year i'm glad to be here you know despite everything else that might be going on around the world or around me i'm really really happy to be here and i hope you are too yeah so just to check on you guys and um yeah i hope you are doing good um and just you know trying to keep your head afloat you know with everything going on in the world i also felt like i needed to give you a little bit of an update you know on the direction my channel is going to take on this year and i also want to reflect on what i did last year what was good what wasn't good you know going forward what would i take on you know into this new year um i'm an accountant i don't know if you know so i i like to plan you know i like to, i'm not a spontaneous person in fact, I hate spontaneity. I really hate what I, I hate surprises. So I like to kind of like preempt and plan things. You know, that's that that's the way I am. Um, so that is my plan again for this um, channel. I don't know if I ever mentioned this. I don't think I've ever mentioned it on my channel, but I felt like this is the right time. You know, I did not start this YouTube channel um, for I don't know popularity or for not even for commercial reasons i started my youtube channel in 2020 i believe it was after the when the pandemic started and i started it because i was almost losing my mind in the house now i'm used to working sometimes even 12 hours you know in a day and to go from that 12 hours sometimes six days sometimes seven days because i used to work for like a, a motorsport company and sometimes um we had events you know all week and as an as the accountant i had to be there you know to make sure that everything to do with money you know was all okay so sometimes i do work seven days a week so to go from 12 hours sometimes you know seven days a week to nothing in the pandemic was a lot for me i mean the first month it felt like holiday the second month it still felt like oh yeah i'm on holiday by the third month i was nearly losing my mind and you know i just had to do something bear in mind i was supposed to start my youtube channel in 2016 but because of my schedule i had no time absolutely no time that i could even devote to youtube so i kept on pushing it back pushing it back in fact i bought my gadgets and everything my lighting and stuff in 2016 but i had no time to do it but fast forward to 2020 pandemic yeah i just thought now is the time especially because nobody was going anywhere and i had all this makeup you know i used to do i mean i've mentioned it here i used to do my makeup every day before pandemic i did full face full face of everything as in real full beat so i had the makeup i had everything i had eyeshadow coming from my hairs you know so i had everything i needed to start this channel and that's why i started the channel just just something for my well-being mental health you know that was why i started this channel it's an outlet for me as much as do what my viewers will enjoy i also like to do what you know i enjoy doing so that's why i don't tend to copy what other people are doing and i hope you will stick with me and love what i do on my channel i do try to do a little bit of what everybody will enjoy but mostly i tend to just do you know what i love because yeah when i love something for me it comes out naturally and i can put my all in it but admittedly yeah sometimes i'm pushed for time 
I've got right now I've got about four videos that I've filmed that I don't even have time to edit or I've not been able to edit or some I've edited quarter edited I mean I did the ranking last year I used to do the monthly ranking of my palette which I absolutely love and I would include the looks you know I did with each palette I absolutely love it and I really want to continue it this year I think I stopped well July July I filmed the August and September which I'm currently editing <laughs> We're in 2023 and I still haven't published a video. I haven't filmed my October to December yet. Luckily for me, I didn't. I don't think I did much looks in December, so I shouldn't have even in that three months. I shouldn't have more than 20 palettes. But I haven't filmed the video because I, it's it's a struggle to find time, you know, outside other stuff, you know, to be able to concentrate on youtube either filming or editing honestly it is a struggle and not having the time also to film and edit is also affecting my mental health i don't know it's like i can't win <laughs> you know i haven't got the time to film and edit youtube videos and i also feel like i'm missing out or something is missing you know is this has been part of me for what, almost is it two years now or almost two years i don't know you do the maths but it's been part of me for a long time that every time i'm away from youtube in terms of filming and editing it affects me somehow it feels like i'm not complete yeah so it, it is a struggle finding the balance yeah i am hoping if you permit me to still film i really want to you know finish the whole year have my ranking my monthly ranking from january to december represented um even if i publish it in february i still want to do it and i also want to carry it on this year because i did enjoy it it's a lot of work but i enjoy it palettes are my thing if you've been on this channel you know i love palettes palettes are my thing foundation and all other stuff there yeah, by the way blushes palette yeah definitely my thing so for me everything to do with palette i always enjoy i enjoy filming i enjoy editing them yeah you know looks and all sort of things i enjoy um another thing i also did last year was panning i did complete the panning project although i said i was going to come and give you the final decision on which of the palettes are actually deporting or the cluttering or keeping you know out of all the four quarters of my panning project which i did which i will still film when i do have the time but i one thing i realized with the panning project is i'm not in any position to even start any panning project and the reason being is i've got too many palettes to even try and pan some how can i pan well i was picking out five i think in one of the quarters i picked six so in total for the whole year i picked 21 palettes 21 palettes out of all of my collection is like it's nothing it's nothing so i don't think i'm in a position to try and do a panning project i really need to bring down the number of my palettes first as in dramatically drastically before i can think of trying to pan palettes because it was just a struggle <laughs> it was a struggle i mean there were so many palettes and lying there and then there were so many you know hiring me from different brands and then to try and pan this 21 palette yeah i think i was kidding myself so my intention this year is to do a drastic drastic decluttering of my palette now i don't think i would have time to film it because the last one i filmed last year i have one on my channel it took me three four days to prepare for that video and to put everything back when i finished that video right now it's just not something that i have the resource to do so i'm not going to lie to myself so what i was thinking of was i'm not going to do a collection video but i'm going to do a video of what i am going to declutter you know and give away throw away whatever it's as a separate video regardless of when it does come be it march april whatever I'm going to do a clutter this year because, yeah, I cannot carry on like that. I definitely have to cut at least half of my collection off. And then what I'm going to do is, at some point, again, don't hold me to that. I want to do all the palettes that I've added to my collection since my last declutter. So this will be possibly the ones I added in 2022. Plus, at whichever point I do that video, whichever palette I buy in 2023. So... I don't want to do a repeat of what i did last year yeah i have shown my collection at the end of last year and that's that then i will show what will no longer be part of my collection 2023 which is what i'm decluttering i will show that video and then the video of all my new palettes since my last declutter 
so i think those two those two videos are the best bet you know that it would feel less overwhelming and very useful for me because once i pick out what i wanted to cut i can just declutter and get rid of them and focus on what i have yeah so that is my intention so yeah definitely all the videos <laughs> the videos are filmed i haven't edited yet i am on them i would edit them and i still want to feature them on my channel because it took time it took time to film them i might not have been in a position you know mentally to edit them but like I said, I'm getting better now, so yeah, I can edit them and, and you know publish them on my channel. Another thing that um, I don't want to do so much of is all videos. For for a start, I don't want to buy as much makeup as I used to buy. It doesn't matter whether I don't spend money on other things because I don't buy any other things. The only things I buy is makeup and perfumes. I hate buying clothes and I hate absolutely hate buying shoes in fact I, I don't get the point i mean where am i even wearing the shoes to so i d i don't i don't spend money on anything else beyond perfumes and makeup so even if those are the only things i buy i still don't just want to buy them out of you know buying sake so what i've been doing is um i've been unsubscribing you know from mailing lists of a lot of brands because it's, it's just wasteful it's just wasteful one day i just kind of like looked at all of my palettes and i'm thinking it's so wasteful some of them are getting to the point that i would have to throw them away because they're no longer in a condition that they should be and if you think of palettes like maybe from pamagrat and natasha denona they weren't cheap so there's only so many years that they can survive you know it, it, it's just wasteful and i definitely want to do less hauls because i think it's triggering for me anyway i'm starting to feel like it triggers so towards the end of last year you will notice that i didn't i stopped doing whole videos on my channel because especially with what's going on in the world i just think it's a bit of a slap in the face yeah yeah makeup brings us happiness satisfaction it's in therapy and everything but i think i can do enough therapy you know with limited amount of oils on my channel and I'm still getting the joy my viewers are still getting the joy than you know to do constant hauls yeah I, I even if I kind of like you know keep my money not used on anything I just want to avoid buying palettes all over again and for me that is the part of makeup that I really enjoy anyway blushes and, and palettes I'm not really the type to buy this many types of foundation in fact I'm setting my ways I hardly change my foundation or try new foundation when I find one that works you know I tend to like you know stick to them yeah in a year I might try maybe two new foundation or three new foundation maximum but that's about it yeah, so I do want to minimize that and just not trigger anybody I want the fun you know to be had in makeup the therapy to be had in makeup to be what i already have in my collection i want to reuse my palettes i want to reuse my palette not me using my palette once twice and you know i don't touch that palette again until sometimes i might not even touch the palette again or maybe until after a few months yeah that that's just not right i think it's wasteful and i really want to kind of like you know move away from that yeah i'm not saying i will not buy a new palette i mean who am i kidding i love palettes <laughs> I love palettes, especially when they are beautiful, beautiful color story. Or it has the colors I like, even if I already have that color story and I really like it, I was still buy it. But yeah, I'm trying to come away from that definitely and reuse, you know, what I have. Um, so yeah, that's my intention. And I also still have, I think I have three months of um, Pilui um, budget box to, to unbox. Yeah, that's another video that... <laughs> <laughs> I really need to film as well. So what I'm going to do with that one is I'm going to film um, the three months together, you know, and then make my decision whether I want to continue with the subscription or not. Yeah. So that's another one. Yeah. And that's my plan, you know, on this channel. And last year I mentioned doing some finance videos, which I never got to do um, in 2022. I am definitely doing them in 2023. Because with the way things are in the world, I think we all need to kind of watch our finances and just, you know, manage our money more. And I think it will be useful. Um, yeah, I know it might not get as many views as 
you know other kind of um videos on my channel but even if it helps one person if it helps even if it helps me if it helps me you know it helps me stay on point you know if it helps me manage my money more and resist temptation more then yeah i'm gonna do those videos uh because it's, it's self-fulfilling for me here yeah, regardless of you know what views come from it yeah i don't want to do it just for the views like i said i did not start this channel for commercial reasons it would be nice of course to make money i mean who doesn't want to make money it'd be nice to make money from me yeah but that wasn't my sole reason or you know the purpose you know of to which i started my channel this channel was a lifesaver for me you know at the time and that's the way i see it yeah if something else comes from it yeah you know i will welcome with open arms but yeah I think I am gonna do what I enjoy and I'm gonna do what I think will be useful you know for viewers either my existing subscribers or new subscribers that might you know come to know about this channel or about me yeah that is my plan because something you might not know I've said this in a few of my videos I'm an introvert I'm an extreme introvert in fact I remember the first time I did my video I was shaking inside as in proper shaking I could it was so difficult to talk it took ugh, god knows how many videos it took to even get some level of confidence i know you might not show but i am a total total introvert as in ugh, socializing is horror for me it's horror it's it's just yeah so being on youtube ugh, people that really knows me they they ask me how i do it you know people that really know that i'm an introvert so i know it doesn't sometimes it doesn't come across as that but yeah i am an introvert so i definitely um appreciate you know people that show me love and um watch my video comment on my video and support me really yeah it's definitely appreciated be it on instagram or youtube whatever i just wanted my points to come across and all my plans um to come across in this video yeah i hope i'm not forgetting anything if i do forget anything i might just put it in the description section i don't know if anybody reads it but i might put it in the description section or maybe do a separate post on instagram or something oh and by the way what do you think of my wig my daughter doesn't like the wig but i kind of like it i like it i like the white you know coming from the black let me know what you think in the, in the comment section is he okay is he not okay should i put a scarf you know to cover the black beat but well, i i think i like it i like it yeah let me know what you think it's a wig is um it's from a company i found on um tiktok so i bought three weeks i've i've won two now i haven't won the third one the third one is a very long wig that i have to kind of trim the top and i'm not good at those kind of things if i anything that is extra nah <laughs> it's a lot it's a lot that i have to trim the lace you know in the front Ugh, i don't know i don't know this one just came like that i didn't have to trim anything yeah so it's just kind of and it's synthetic as well so you just kind of like shed but not so much and yeah i had to do nothing literally just put it on no trimming of anything yeah i don't like it i like it yeah but let me know what you think about the week please let me know what you want to see from me this year um I, and i would definitely take it under consideration even if it's something that is um more difficult for me to do whatever i, I would definitely take it into consideration very soon in like um two in like three four months time i should be in a position where i have more i want to say more liberty you know to be free on this channel to to do more and be more of myself so fingers crossed i'm open in like three months time you will definitely see a different side you will start then seeing things like uh, shop my stash i've mentioned it before that i have very limited space for filming and every time i have to film i have to get all the stuff out so it, it's extremely difficult and for this particular look and this today i have i'm filming three videos because once i put this out this is it i don't know the next time i'm going to be able to film again so i have to kind of plan my video so i've been well i've been filming for well, about six hours now so this is definitely the third video i'm doing today yeah so once i am in that place i'll be able to speak to you more about my circumstances and things you know that i've not been able to speak about and things that you would definitely be able to see on my channel will be things like shop my stash and you'll be able to see more of my collection i've got a beautiful collection but 
there's no way I can show you right now just because of this setup and everything but yeah I'm looking forward to, yeah, to show you my collection so I hope to see more of you on my channel please continue to share my videos um, like comment you know subscribe because I know some people watch me without subscribing subscribe to my channel you know you know share share my platform share my platform out you know let other people know more about me as well you know people that you know like the kind of things i like colorful looks and stuff like that you know palettes and you know all the all the works yeah so i appreciate you i see you and i appreciate your support especially in 2023 and i look forward you know to bringing out more content you know to make my viewers happy and to make my subscribers happy yeah and i think that's it that's um, all i wanted to say if you've enjoyed this video please like it share it and subscribe to my channel i would love to have you on this channel i would love to have you on this platform and until next time i'll see you.